Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my fellow YouTubers. We're just about to leave the park because there's clouds over there and it's and not it pretty. Look it looks like tornado clouds. Anyway. At least I heard those anvil clouds are supposed to be tornado clouds and those definitely look like anvil. So. Anyways, before we ship out, we I need to talk about we'll the taste of the day. I found the dill pickle race chips to be kind of real mild in the dill and because of that they weren't really all that good so far i like the pringles dill best and well uh the roasted garlic that rita had it had a real good garlic flavor to it and actually it was rather addictive so i might have to get a bag myself one day they are i had to shovel it in because of the store yeah, as for the ginseng uh, honey tea that i had uh that actually got really good as i went through it more uh it I think it needed to be colder though. I want to say the drink right there before I ship out the fuse that I'm drinking, which is half a bottle, which I will finish at home, is very addictive as well. So, with that said, we must ship out and we must uh, head what do you home. What think of the roasted garlic and the dill? You tried them both? Uh, the dill know? chip, in my opinion, I didn't like. Uh, even though I had one chip, the roasted garlic was just addictive. And very good. It didn't taste like garlic, but it tasted like garlic, if you get what I mean. It's kind it of... It tasted like roasted garlic. Yes. It's different than garlic. Mm-hmm. It'd be a good way to drink too much, eat those chips, and try to fake out the cops with the garlic test. Yeah, except for that won't make you pass breathalyzer. <laughs> I know. They, they've sampled all sorts of things and tested them, and it doesn't work. Yay to Mythbusters for trying to figure some things out. Uh-huh. I saw once these garlic pills you buy for six bucks. They were supposed to work at a over the yeah, counter. Yeah, they don't work. <laughs> Anyways, please add and subscribe if you like. Please post comments in the and box actually, if you like. Actually, if you want to know the one thing that's best for passing a breathalyzer, uh, there is a uh, what do you call it? There's uh, one of these challenges on YouTube. It's called the Fluffy Bunny Challenge. And you take these marshmallows, and you cram as many as you can into your mouth and say Fluffy Bunny. And it'll actually absorb some of the alcohol from your cheeks and stuff that it's absorbed in. But uh, you'll probably still fail a breathalyzer. But it, at least it's a fun little challenge if you're ever interested in trying something stupid. Before Just I go, yourself and say Fluffy Bunny every time you add a marshmallow. Before I go, I do want to say that if any of you watching this... Go to your YouTube channel selection, go to your search button, I mean, and put in Battle Shots and watch the comedy <laughs> about that because now that is real drinking. I'm Mary Sky signing off on location with a windstorm now approaching.